asexual reproduction. Reproduction is the creation of a new individual or individuals from previously existing individuals. In animals, this can occur in two primary ways, through asexual reproduction and through sexual reproduction. Asexual reproduction In this type of reproduction, neither the sex cells nor gametes are formed, nor do they unite to form the zygote. Moreover, the participation of two organisms, male and female, is not required. Only one organism reproduces. During asexual reproduction, the body, somatic cells divide, their nucleus divides, either by mitosis or amitosis. Therefore, such type of reproduction is also known as somatogenic or blastogenic reproduction. The asexual reproduction is commonly found in lower animals such as protozoans, sponges, coelenterates, certain worms and tunicates. There are different ways by which organisms reproduce asexually such as 1. Binary fission 2. Budding 3. Gemule in sponges or gemulation 4. Fragmentation 1. Binary fission this is the simplest and most common method of asexual reproduction seen in unicellular organisms. This occurs under the favorable conditions of the environment. After the organism is grown to its full size, the parent divides into two daughter cells which are genetically and morphologically similar. During this process, the nucleus divides into two, followed by the division of the cytoplasm. Two, budding. It is the process in which cells of an organism split into parent and daughter cells. For example, organisms like sponges and hydra reproduce by means of budding. In hydra, this process is similar to that of reproduction in yeasts. Initially, a small bud is formed on the side of the body which enlarges and develops tentacles, which help in feeding the daughter bud that breaks off from the parent body. In organisms like echinoderms and jellyfish, the buds break off and form their independent bases. The mechanism is different in corals and their buds do not detach from their parent body, leading to formation of large colonies. 3. Gemule in sponges or gemulation Asexual reproduction occurs in sponges in various ways. The best known method is gemulation. In freshwater sponges, and a few marine sponges, buds are formed within the parent body and are called gemules. These are also called as endogenous buds or internal buds. 4. 
fragmentation. It involves breaking of parent organism into two or many fragments. Each fragment develops into an individual organism. Fragmentation is seen in sea stars which accidentally break their body into fragments. Advantages of Asexual Reproduction 1. A large number of individuals are produced within a short period from a single parent. 2. The offsprings are genetically identical to the parent. 3. It occurs only through simple mitotic division. 4. It helps in dispersal of young ones to far-off places. 5. It also helps the animal to tide over unfavorable environmental conditions. Disadvantages of Asexual Reproduction 1. Continuous binary fission for several generations makes the daughter individuals genetically weak and requires rejuvenation. 2. Animals produced by asexual reproduction are generally less adaptable to changing environmental conditions. 3. Since the genetic constitution of the daughter individuals is similar to the parent, there is no genetic variation in the offsprings and hence does not contribute to speciation.